Ladies and gentlemen, here it is. Your prayers, Andron. Oh, you are so confident. Here we go, everybody. Oh, no you don't. No you don't. don't nice try, though. Cocky, Let's see how you handle our new <laughs> I love it. You just, you just go in there and you just start spam shooting him. Get down, Pigma. Get down, bastard. Oh, that was a pull. There goes one. Ow! Stop running into me. I really need to keep my lasers, please. There's one. What do you mean you guys don't give up? We haven't even fought them yet. This is actually our first time fighting them. Uh, that's a way to say it. You're good, but I'm better. Where is that wolf? I want to hear that from you. It's hilarious when you say that. Hold on a second. So Pigma's almost dead. Wolf is still floating around. I need to take care of him. Let's get rid of you. And I've got a better trigger finger. Also, I keep crashing into shit. It is, I'm afraid. I'm sorry, buddy. It's just how it happens. There was that gold ring that I really wanted. I don't know where it went, though. Okay, come on. Let me quickly get you. Oh, no, no. Wolf, 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 sir. Wolf. We're not playing this game of chicken here. You're good, but I'm better. Mm. Not necessarily, I'm afraid. Where'd you go? Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. No See ya, buddy. I don't believe it. And I'll just take that, because why not? And we have gotten the hit score here. I'll go it alone from here. And it's time for the final boss in the game, which is. I'm sorry, it's, just, it's just so easy. Got it, Andros. So tactic to fighting Andros is pretty simple. First weak spot are his eyes. Okay, you want to take out his hands to get rid of him. Just shoot the eyes, and then he gets all uh, irritated, and then you shoot the hands. Okay. There goes one hand. Now shoot at the eyes again. Keep shooting at him. He gets irritated again. Take out the other hand, and then shoot at the face. That's all there is to it. Wait. Where is it? Only I have the brains to rule my life. So, Andros, you show your true form. Here we go, everybody. True form of Andros. Let's do this thing. Great. Here come the eyeballs of doom. Oh, almost got, got one. Okay, let's turn it around. We just want to take out the eyeballs first thing. Try not to get caught in the electric stream between them, though. The eyeballs can shoot lasers at you, so be wary of that. Stay away from him, from the actual him, for the time being. You don't want to get near that yet. There was one eyeball. And that is worth a few points. Six points, to be exact. Wow. Okay, and now let's get rid of the other one. Almost got it, almost got it. And then, as soon as you have taken care of that business, you go after him. Now, the way to take care of him, because he's just going to come after you and try to suck it, suck you in, is to shoot at the center of him. Flip yourself around really quickly, and then you start shooting at the brown area in his brain. Turn him around, flip again. There you go. Keep doing that over and over. Over and over. Until finally... It. You just keep because he keeps appearing behind you. That's it. If I go down, I'm taking you with me. Don't ever 
give up, my son. Father? Follow me, Fox. This way, Fox. Never give up. Trust your instincts. Lol. And I'm just gonna shoot this bomb off because I'm never gonna use it again. Oh no, father, don't go into that. So oh. Oh, hey, thanks, Dad. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is Star Fox 64. First game I ever beat as a kid. Love it to death. Love it to death. Beat it when I was only five years old, actually. Love this game. So much fun. Oh, it's such a classic. That's our leader. What's wrong, Fox? Nothing. Nothing's wrong. Oh, and sweet, I did beat my top. Okay. Awesome. We did it, guys. That's it. And that is going to be the end of, well, today. A lot of videos I put out today. It was all... These videos were not, you know, oh, I'm going to just put out a bunch... No, these were videos were kind of as like a thank you to everybody. I mean, I really appreciate everything that everyone has ever done for me in the last three years. Let's play. I have had so much fun doing it. It has been such an awesome experience meeting so many cool people and just doing something that I love and then getting appreciated for it and finding out that I'm impacting other people in positive ways. It's just it's so surreal almost. I mean it's been such a fantastic experience and I don't think I'll ever stop. I love it so much. It's so much fun. I really enjoy sharing these gaming experiences with everybody because they are so integral to it as who I am and they mean so much to me and at the same time it's just it's so much fun I love being an entertainer I love it I love being a total idiot over the microphone for everybody else to laugh at because I don't care if you're laughing with me or at me as long as you're laughing that's all that matters it it, it's just, uh, it's so fun. It's so fun. Every moment since I started Let's Play has been truly worth it. Even the good, even the bad. The bad for the growing experience, the good for every other possible reason. I've just had so much fun over the last three years, and I want to say three years from now that I'm still having fun. I want to say ten years from now, if Let's Play is still relevant at that point, that I'm having fun. Because it, it just doesn't get old. It, it's so fun. I don't, I don't want it to end. And it's... It's just... Uh, it's been so amazing, you guys. It really has been. Every game we've played together. Every moment that we shared. Every stupid... Stu moment of stupidity that I've had. Every moment of failure. Every moment of awesome in gameplay. It's all been so, so great. And... <sighs> wouldn't trade it for the world. Wouldn't trade it for the world. Star Fox, we are in your debt. I would be honored to have you as part of the Cornarian... Oh no, sir. We prefer doing things our own way. Great Fox is ready to go. It's time for us to go now. 
but yes so as soon as the current let's plays and no I don't mean the ones I did today <laughs> the current let's plays as in the last of us Bioshock Midnight Club Uncharted 2 as soon as all of these have come to an end we're gonna be returning to a daily rotation or a da basically a daily or a, that's that's a bad way to put it. a single LP there will be some occasional side LPs that are run for a while but the main LP will be uploaded daily um, regardless that's how it's gonna go just so we can I can start focusing on one game at a time and make the content for that single LP better as we go because oh, it's that's that's what needs to happen we need to we just need to have a whole focus on it and I, I really want to make these things more personal um, this this next 12 months following today I have so many big plans for games that we're going to play through. Um, included in it is going to be um, the most important LP I'm going to be doing possibly ever on my channel. And as well as um, a few awesome blind LPs that I've been wanting to do for a while. Some continuations of series we've done in the past. As well as um, the occasional dud of a game that no one would have ever expected in a million years, but um, is going to end up on my channel regardless, because it's a game that I have a huge fascination slash nostalgia for. But, with that guys, this has been the Squirtle King. Thank you so much for watching my videos, thank you so much for watching my, my videos in the future, Thank you so much for being a part of this experience, and I will see you all in the next one.